you say you want to get married before you start having children remember the condition of your country and make sure you have means of support before you start having children and if you are living in a place called africa stop producing many children produce the one you can train the third part of this is in our marriages oh man this one Many of, many of them will come here pervert in this one because what I want to say now, although one time when I was still a Christian, a prophetess, you know, she created a group and wanted us to talk about it. And I said later we make a, uh, maybe a separate message on this and I will, I will title it Redemption Porn. Many of you are having boring sex life in your marriage. In this time and age, you are having boring sex life. What type of human being are you? Your parents didn't even have boring sex life, but you are having it now. <laughs> I will open your eyes so you will see. <laughs> How can you be living today and you say no porn? You are stupid. You sing redemption song. But you don't want redemption porn. Porn can save you. You say, no, it's not. I mean, when I mean save you, help you assess life. Some of you know your husband drink alcohol, right? So they drink certain things that help them perform. So if they can take those chemicals to make them perform, so you don't know that porn can help you perform. It's a fact, porn will make both of you perform better. Because both of you watching it will help you, you know, get aroused. Then, you know, you begin to do certain things you see. You say, why are you saying that? Are you saying porn is wrong? You know, I never say that porn is right. The same way war movie is right. The same way roman ro romance movie is right. The same way drama movie is right. The same way comedy movie is right. So you can watch horror movie with your husband and wi or wife. So you can watch war movies with your wife or husband, but you cannot watch porn with them. It's the same thing, people acting, not you. You're watching people acting. It's the same thing with whatever movie you watch, porn is the same thing. It is people who are telling, no, you don't watch, just as they tell you, don't dress like this, don't wear this, don't wear that. You know, before, religion was against doggy style. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> they said the only sex position accepted, acceptable is missionary one. See, missionary criminals. It does um, the woman will lay on her back, the man climb on top of on top of her. Not maybe you know how we rock it. We try to go east, west, north, and south. Okay, <laughs> you know, man, they will go deeper. You know, we try to, like when I was growing up, not now, old, but when I was growing up, it, we it used to be our bragging right. We want to make the woman cry. And we feel great, you know, not that we make them cry bad, at least make them satisfied, that's what I mean. You, we want to satisfy that woman that she will always want it. So you no longer, you no longer be spending much time talking about it. What are you watching together? as married people as husband and wife what are you watching together if you are watching any type of movie together or any type of tv show together but you are against watching porn together you are stupid i'm calling on you now to redeem your sex life even if they say oh you're having sexual uh, erect, uh, erectile dysfunction Porn can help you. When you see them doing it, your blood will keep pumping while you are fucking your wife or your girlfriend. I said it. <laughs> they may block me, but I don't care. <laughs> but think about it. I remember when I was in theological school, in Grace Theological Seminary, Oba. 
So the lecturer came in one morning. Then he, he asked us a question. He said, if you go for missionary work, your wife did not go with you. Will you masturbate? <laughs> or, you know, sleep around? That's the end of the class. Argument everywhere. You know, ministers now, people going to theological school, they are ministers, so they begin to argue. No, 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 he's sin, it's evil. No, how can you do that? Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> you telling me I should marry somebody I don't actually like to marry, or it's not the type of person I don't want to spend my life with, but I will marry her because I need somebody to be having sex with. No. That's the worst mistake you ever make. It's better you masturbate than stay in such relationship. Keep masturbating. When you see somebody to fuck you, fuck and continue. Until you see the person you can spend, the person that have understanding. Imagine marrying somebody that don't, don't want to watch porn, but you like watching porn. That, you see how boring that says would be. That's why you see that man looking outside. When she sees some, the way some lady dress, say, I think this one dressed like some of them in porn. She may know how to perform. Let me go. <laughs> My wife don't do. Well, the wife will go to the other corner, start going to church. Whatever that is making my husband not to pay attention to me, not to be stay at home. I bind you. I cast you. No, you are the one. You are the demon that is driving your husband away. Uh, I was working with a one man. He's a nurse. He said that his wife, they, they divorced. I said, why do you divorce? He said, I want to have uh, an access with the wife. The wife said, no. <laughs> he wants to send her to her. That's how they divorce. Simple thing. Somebody say, oh, I want to travel abroad. Can you help me? Blah, blah, blah. I said, okay. <laughs> If a man asks to sleep with you so that he will help you to travel, will you do that? She said, no. I said, then you are not ready to travel. Are you a virgin? She said, no. I said, see how stupid you are. The person that you are sleeping with will not help you to travel. <laughs> but you meet somebody, you know, say, let that person help you. It's okay. I will have sex with you to help you. You say, no, it will never happen. But you are not a virgin. And the person you are with is not even your husband. You are stupid. And many of you are like that. Then when some stupid, we have some stupid men that will still help you to travel that abroad. Then you kick them out and bring their boyfriend or marry whoever you want and they will be regretting it. Men, wake up. Women also wake up. Because there are some men, some women travel from America to marry them from Africa and bring, uh, in Africa and bring them to America. They came here and treat the woman like bullshit. It's like business. But what am I saying? In your marriage, remember marriage is slavery. The man is the master. The woman is the slave. You say it's not true. That's your business. But check the history. Check the origin of marriage. It's not African. It's Western stuff. That's why they give you that ring. That's the ring of ownership. That's sign, symbol of ownership. I own you. They say, no, you be, the, man, the man belongs to you. No, it's not true. It's not they are changing it. It's, uh, no. He's the man. <laughs> over you. He must rule over you. Let me ask you a question. Will you rather masturbate than sleep around when your wife or husband is not around. Whatever your answer, keep it to yourself. But I want you to ignite that sex fire again in your marriage. You know how you used to fuck before you get married? Yes, the body of the woman must change. It's a natural thing. But there's another way to go about it. Yes, the more they mature, the grip will no longer be there. But there's a way you can... Tell her to move her body. She can, she can do that. She can start learning all that. She can learn it from porn. You can teach it 
and teach her that. You have slept some people that have better sense, uh, know how to do better sense than your wife. Then teach it to your wife. Teach it to your wife. That is sharing knowledge. You have that knowledge already. There are many pawns in your head, especially men. Some men don't need pawn to perform because they have many pawns in their head. When they are fucking their wife, they are thinking about that one they fucked before. That a hap is natural. But they will not tell you the truth. I keep saying it. Men don't say the truth. Just as some of them suffer suffering domestic violence, but they will not say it. But their wife is tormenting their life. Wake up. In your marriage, remember both of you come together for better, not for worse. Both of you come together. It's like in business. When you two, see two people that come to start a business, they come there for them to make profit, not for them to be losing. No. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> people are complaining about the pictures I use. Right I like one guy. One guy, he's sending me, you know, porn clips uh, on on the uh, inbox. I say, yeah, it's good. Then I will share it later. One woman sent me. I think it's in South Africa. She says she have uh, she's doing porn. You know, she want me to join all that. Okay, I say she don't know who he's talking to. Mm -hmm. But you know why I'm using those pictures? Because that's what they get attention of our people. Although they claim to be holy, especially those women. They are not virginal, they claim to be holy. You see them singing, Jehovah carry me, go to my husband's house. <laughs> Queen Jehovah will carry you, go to your husband's house. Idiot. <laughs> when you believe Jesus is your, is your best friend, Jesus is your this year. You don't know one word you say will drive that man away. Oh, before you do, let us pray. <laughs> you are in trouble. If you marry such woman, you are already in trouble. Because you begin to see all the evil spirits in your village against you. You may be, oh, we're not going to our village until so, 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 until we pray, until we fast, until we do this. In your marriage, both of you are in charge. I never married my wife as marriage other stage. And till today, I don't treat her like that. My ex had that problem. That's why I divorced her. But this one now, she's great. <laughs> uh, I will not divorce her. I will never divorce this one. Unless she decides, if she's that tomorrow we, di we divorce, or she decides to go contrary to my will, okay? No fight. Go your way. I don't support you hitting any woman unless she comes to hit you. I don't support you divorcing any woman unless she don't want to continue with you. Don't force any relationship. Don't force any marriage, no matter what it costs you. And that's why when they establish marriage as our people, you see, they, they, they make you go through a lot of things so that you will not think divorce both man and the woman so you will not think divorce you behave yourself but we call it family african family structure not marriage because marriage is between a man and a woman but in african family structure it is between family and family and you can connect with many as many family as you want see? <laughs> in closing Fear of God makes one a victim. Fear of God. If God exists, there will be no need for, for you to fear God. You're supposed to know God. You're not supposed to believe in God. You're supposed to know God. See God. If God exists. They say, can you see the air? Yes. <laughs> can you see your city? Yes. Can you see your brain? Yes. I can see them. If they are real, I can see them. If not everything that is real, you can see. Who tell you that? Then how can you say it's real when nobody has seen it? <laughs>